We're not out of the woods yet here in Utah when it comes to COVID-19, and it might be a while before we are. That's the latest from doctors at the University of Utah during a news update this morning. Fox 13 Scott McCain is live and joins us now with the very latest on what they had to say. Hi, Scott. Yeah, good morning, guys. Uh, kind of a broken record, but again, they want to stress to the public a couple of things. And first and foremost, in a nutshell, if people out there are not listening to certified doctors and scientists about Omicron, uh, that it's not that dangerous. Uh, you're kind of up in the night because uh, this is still a very real situation we're dealing with. Uh, you know, all the hype about this not being as bad, uh, sort of uh, really not accurate at this point. It's a situation where uh, this variant of the coronavirus is four times more contagious than the Delta variant, and it is affecting greater numbers of people, in particular, younger children. And doctors say, once again, being vaccinated and boosted is still the very best way to avoid getting Omicron in the first place. But if you do contract it, which is becoming more and more likely, it will likely be manageable. And 80% of the people in the hospital right now, including children, are unvaccinated. So there's still a lot of severe disease occurring among people who are unvaccinated. And they shouldn't take too much comfort in the fact that it's somewhat less severe than Delta because it's so much more infectious. Yeah, Dr. Pavia says, uh, you know, among other things, now is definitely not the time to let our guard down regarding things like wearing masks, in particular N95 masks, and he's glad more of those are becoming available. Also, uh, home testing, which is becoming available as of yesterday uh, to the greater population of the U.S. He also says it is just a guess as to whether or not we have reached a peak. You know, he says, look, I've been studying viruses my entire career, and we just don't know. We know we don't know if there's another variant that lurking out there that could be just as contagious and possibly even more dangerous uh, than the Omicron variant. So, it, you know, in a nutshell, again, not a time to let our guard down, to be vigilant, uh, to continue things like safe social distancing, mask wearing and getting vaccinated and boosted. For now, we're live in West Valley City. Scott McCain, Fox 13 News, Utah.